Welcome to Entertainment Gist, where everything that trends on social media comes live on it. My name is Kali Obi, aka DJ Kali, and I don't do the salon. I'm always on my right or die. Beautiful day, beautiful people. Welcome. My name is Jennifer Obuse, aka Simple Woman by Nature. And here are the headlines. Hush Puppy used to run a legitimate business before his arrest. Gal Pizetsky. Guess who has a new apartment now? You hear the Fujis? Don't worry. <laughs> Diamond Platinums used to beat me up, but I enjoyed it. Actress Wima Sepetu. No way. I am no longer a boy, I'm a full grown man, says Techno. Let's go on this break, we'll be right back. Stay still, stay tuned. <laughs> Promo, promo. Sweet Dry Cleaner has brought an amazing opportunity to its esteemed and soon-to-be customer as we offer a first-class dry cleaning service. If you work with us and your transaction is up to 10,000 naira, you get to watch 10 children casual wear or 5 adult casual wear for free from 1st July to 31st July. For more information, contact us at number 12 Olowara Road by First World Bus Stop of Isheri behind Omole Phase 2 or call And hear about about your favorite celebrities now hush puppy's issue <laughs> is actually no, something the guy that is growing like a con he's becoming so famous no, he was famous he, but now he's tripling this yes you know where you say global he's, mm, he's now he's global now global. criminal lawyer popular chicago criminal lawyer top There's criminal lawyer yes michael Gal Jackson, yeah. yes michael Jackson's ex lawyer had an interview with forbes and he was actually saying oh abbas used to run a legitimate business and forbes said okay so what's the business and he said to them he owns a real estate and a, a he also yes he also promotes brands on social media and then gets paid so i'm not wondering <laughs> Hello. Where oh, he was just arrested because he was said to. <laughs> and that's not the first time we've been getting a fraudulent yeah. act. So I don't know where he's getting. I'm saying, his own he's going to support him. He's going to try to fight for his um, client and everything. He's been paid for it, so he's doing his lawyer job. Well, it is not a charge and being okay, lawyer. So, Kali, what this if is it's true? What, what if it's true? How yes. does he get the money? See, is what, he come, come, so come, what Jennifer? If, what if it's true? What if <laughs> the whole running. the hush puppy we are all crucifying probably be legitimate? You never can tell. Yes, because his lawyer is just saying it, Jennifer. and we all know. Is it the first time that he's been arrested for for fraud? That's the question. We all know that people engage in various kinds of business, in various businesses, and they probably might not tell you, oh, this is where I'm actually getting my money from. Mm -hmm. And if he's saying, oh, I promote brands and they pay me, and they pay me very well, you can imagine probably earning How did he start his brands in promotion? In, in, just promoting a brand. It was very expensive. See, he was just to match on everybody's face that's what i feel if he had the money yes but being on social media and media and fronting a lot come on okay come so guess on. what now the surprising thing here is that this hush puppy story always comes with a twist now mm. hush puppy if the prime minister of St. Kitts and Nevis in the United, United States, States of America is saying hush puppy is a citizen of the United States of America by marriage, by marriage because he okay. married a lady called Shawana yes, Shawana so Chapman and yes yeah, so you are talking about someone who actually see I just feel I, I see him as a very intelligent person, person and smart. I think he's smart he, he actually he, he saw this coming that's my own belief oh, he saw this coming really? now and the thing there is a lot of young people are actually celebrating Hush Puppy I, I stormed onto a comment a where comment. a guy said I'm going to 
take Hush Puppy's picture, his portrait, and put it in my house so that when my kids grow up, I'll tell them that this is a legend. And I'm asking myself, is this not crazy? So he put in Hush Puppy's picture and is going to show his kids that that's a legend. He has misread. You know, you're in your bathroom, you have sonu. Let me just tell you, you have sonu. Because there are so many pictures that you can put up for your kids. Okay, if your kids now ask the guy, how did this guy make his money? What happened? What is the story behind them? Well, that behind is that the story. Thing. That is that because already I, answered if, that. If, I will not be the one that will advise you guys. That's the truth because Hush Puppy, this is not the first time he's going to be caught for fraud. And in Dubai, when he, they, they actually went to catch him like a celebrity, like a. He is a celebrity, he is though. A celebrity. But the way he was caught by the Dubai, that's Interpol, wasn't funny at all. And I don't think I would want to look at that person and put his picture on my wall and see my kids <laughs> to worship him. At the end of the day, we just wish Gal Pizetsky success because i think that's what he needs now You've to be able paid. to convince the court and the world in general you've been paid to do your <laughs> job <laughs> you've been paid there to do that job so let's go to pa james who yeah, just got pa a james. new apartment this guy has been will i say from 2019 when his son samuel yes, his son actually uh, posted, posted a video a, i said he saw the picture of his father scooping water bad. from his house and everything they had this um flood thing happen to them 10 times wow uh, yeah 10 times on a row and he said they've gone to the government and they pleaded to the government to help them well and are they both, going to the government to tell them oh please help me because it's pa james house because we have a lot of people who are actually who, who are actually going through the same thing the thing that is that when, once the range starts the island or probably the places or other places okay, dominated okay, by water do. yes okay though mm -hmm, that's where he said by water uh, probably a, a, a water area, Long where, area. yes where the soccer way is actually poorly and everything. yes it's poorly um, made and I, I think he's not the only one going through it so i'm surprised that his son actually posted or so actually said oh government come and help me he's um a veteran he's a nollywood star we've known this man for a long time and i feel a lot of people when we look at people like this we're like oh they have it all they got it all but these people are suffering silently i i would mention a lot, a lot of them of in the movie industry I agree that with you. we see every day in the movies but come these guys are and not finding it funny they are living and for him, yeah so poor. and for him to go to the government he knew come Others may not, it but this guy it has gotten place. up to this place. He has his family to protect, he has his image to protect, and he has a lot of a lot around him to protect. So him going to the government, I feel the government shouldn't wait for people to come to them and say, help us. Because you're saying it now. It's not it's not our fault that we've been uh, when it rains, our homes get flooded or we've been sacked out of our house as they said. They said I it think was for me, this is also a platform where a lot of you see when you want to get a house probably buy a land or buy an apartment you must ensure that you look very well look around Jenny, the area Jenny, you know? yes i know someone who said to me i wanted to buy a house mm. but i decided to wait when, when it's raining it was, <laughs> yes when it's raining i needed to wait in the month of july because july tells it all yeah. i needed to wait in the month of july for so that i don't buy something that i'll that keep regressing regret. yes so whenever you want to buy a house, you have to ensure that you look into all these things. These things to you are really small. Oh, I can push the water away. But it can become so frustrating when you have to deal with the month of July, probably ending of June, July, August. August. Yes, when you have to keep pushing. Well, you, how long are you going to do this? And a big congratulation to him because yeah, Funke Akindele, Akindele, the amazing Funke Jenny Fast Diary, Diary. decided to show love to You know, there was a time in two Jenny. weeks ago when uh, one of her workers came out and say calling, she, her. calling her that she's not as so nice as she looks I'm like I'm not like come on now. she just got pa james an apartment where is this one we're going to place this accusation now but you know people will always say things well, but will always... Kylie, at the same time let's not forget that and um, never judge a book by its cover and uh, because I... that she's been so nice to pa james I mean, necessarily not mean she's nice to her staff. I, I, and if the girl said so much, I, I remember reading it and I was like, are you sure it's Jennifer? But at the same time, she can never treat her James the way she's going to treat them. What I would say is that uh, we're all humans. Well, it all depends on I how the person left anyway. Let's, let's, I because all those um, employees, some of them are so annoying. Well, but I don't want to jump into it. But anyway, <laughs> forget Kindele. 
O she jare, o she padi mi. A big that... congratulations to Pat James. I hope you enjoy your new yeah. home. Let's go on a break. We'll be right back. Don't forget, this, this is, is Entertainment, Entertainment Gist. Gist. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, DJ Humility. Hello, my name is Jimmy Black. Hi, my name is Rose Tinoala. One, two, one, two. This is DJ Zemo, live from New York City, you know. You're watching. Hi, Brand TV. Shout out to the wonderful job you guys are doing. Shout out to the presenters, to the camera crew, and everyone else. Big ups, yeah? Stay tuned. Thank you. For those of you who's just joining us, this is Entertainment Gist, where we talk about everything. Like I always say, you post it, and guess what? We'll sit on this couch talking, talking about it. <laughs> now, Diamond Platinums, I don't understand this <sighs> story because I feel this girl, I don't want I to am, call her a psychopath, I'm a but I'm, I'm sorry to use that word, shamefulness. but I'm so embarrassed that a woman will come out in this say, very age and time to actually say oh i enjoyed being beaten by a man who does that now actress wima sepetu actually came out during an interview saying oh she dated yeah, diamond platinum, diamond platinum so yeah. a decade ago and she was like oh i remember when i was in a relationship with him he used to beat me and guess what i enjoyed it because that's the very moment where i get the best out of him because really? he's he becomes so caring he pampers me and everything and i'm saying to myself do we really have psychopaths around this one is not just a psychopath is there another word for... Well, I'm not going to use another word because I even just apologize using see, that see, one. See, no, we need to use that. Or there's another word that need, they need to add to this woman's head. Like, why in the world would you enjoy a man hitting you? Why in the world? I used to hear the stories. Some ladies would say, if he does not... There was this relationship, I don't want to call names. And the guy said, the girl left him because he doesn't used to beat her. Wow. That she oh, she wanted to tell you, beat me. She does things and she was telling this guy to say, hit me now, beat me now. And um, because of the guy couldn't do it, she left. She started dating someone else. Wow. And she said the guy used to hit her. I, Jenny, help me out here. Because I don't know what to say. Well, Kali, I'm even, I'm even, I'm even just looking at you. I don't know what to you. say. Okay, so now, Wima Sepetu is actually, she has actually come out to say so much. But I just feel that in the course of saying so much, you're a role model, you're an actress, you're an actress. And a beauty queen. And a lot of young girls look up to you saying, oh, I won't they want to be like Wima Sepetu. So what message are you passing across if you're telling every young girl out there that, mm -hmm. oh, it's mm -hmm. fine, you're talking to not just people from Tanzania, you're talking to everybody from all, every, all over the world yes, have been all over looking the world up to her. Who have been looking up to you. And um, it's just so painful that you you'll be able, you, you will say something like that. Because at the end of the day, we're women and we're role models and we have younger girls or guys who are that actually look up looking to up to us. Yeah. And if you're saying, oh, it's fine for a woman that a man should beat me, then you are not encouraging young guys growing up, telling them that, ah, women are going to love you so no, much because of this. You know one thing, eh? I feel that she was on high drugs before she went for the interview. <laughs> if she wasn't, she should know that whatever she has said has tarnished the image of um, Diamond, diamond platinum. And, uh, me, and this will bring up more stories. This yeah, will bring up yeah, more yeah. stories. It gives, so gives like, back like, to more. <laughs> Babe, you are a celeb. You are, how will I put it? Coming out to say such about yourself. Tell me the next relationship. Will you, will you be respected? Okay, so briefly, Kali, let me just say this. Her family also discovered that she was in a relationship and she was going through domestic violence. And her, her family, family said, oh, leave this relationship. She passed it. During the interview, she said, no, she told her family that I am enjoying this relationship. And that man in 2016, during an interview, interview. made something. He said, Wema Sepetu is one woman he, he has loved. He, he loves and probably he will keep loving because she's one person that actually enjoys understood beating. him and everything. No, enjoys beating. And then during the course of their relationship, whenever the thought of her leaving him comes, he cries. But at the end of the day, I beating think, or not beating, they are not You know one thing, there's, so there's, 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 there's a different kind of relationship that. anyway. I think their relationship was obsession. It wasn't yes, meant yes. to stay. Mm -hmm. It was just something that both of them were obsessed about themselves. Yes. and obsession the beating. Yeah, so I think that wasn't love. 
Love so, is not, you know what, has um, no violence. I don't even want to talk about this because Love the more no I'm violence. talking about it, the more I'm seeing her image, her picture, her <laughs> driving me insane. So let's talk about who is becoming a real man and no longer a boy. So I'm wondering techno. why Techno is actually <laughs> saying that he's going to become a real man. Because he's now, he's now. He's it, now. It, because Lola Ray already has a child In for 2019. Him. Yeah, except he's trying to tell us that, oh, that child wasn't mine. But I'm, I'm not the one saying it. I'm only just wondering <laughs> why he would come out to say oh i'm now I'm not a man yes i'm now a man because you've been a father before yes so i'm so i i was surprised when i saw it because i like oh, he, you had tried it 2019 and you didn't come out to say i'm now a man i'm no longer a boy why on this one why is they're both kids i don't know why Rupa the last time the last time Rupa Rupa not Lola's baby the baby's yes. name is amaka has it. and baby is beautiful has... the baby's name is amaka amaka oh. amaka 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 will not disappoint. Him. Amaka can disappoint <laughs> Techno. So Techno does not want Amaka, Amaka to disappoint. Amaka disappoint. So I saying that. That's why he say, but, uh, "Oh, you 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 brought so much joy." Joy, to my yeah, life. yeah. He said brought so much joy, and he said some things to the fans that they should keep a positive uh, mindset, and they should believe in themselves, and they shouldn't do anything. Well, at the end of the day, I just believe that this is not techno's first child so i will follow this story to the end because Stop i really following want, your story I really up want to ask Leave celebs Dollar alone Ray, why would techno say such a thing and a big congratulation to linda age your four yeah. and ibrahim suleiman <laughs> who just welcomed a newborn baby and he said something we were three <laughs> yes, he used we were we three. So what that's he said nice. is that we are three right now in the family just, and I'm so happy. That couple is one couple that they their names, their pictures never get off my head. Wow. Like they started from teen cell, these guys love them. Stop. Yeah. And so much love, so much love in between both of them. Even when they did a Dudu Care Challenge, she did not come out to do a Dudu Care Challenge. <laughs> so I'm saying to Linda, I love the way you kept it on the low key but for me to you and from iBride and from entertainment just Kali and I will ah. send a big congratulations to you and techno too yes it's been an amazing day today on entertainment G's, and I hope you've enjoyed yourself as much as we did my name is Jennifer Obuse aka simple woman by nature and you can follow me on my Instagram handle at Jennifer underscore Obuse I'm giving it to my girl yes bring it back to me baby my name is Kali Obi aka DJ Kali and we're always doing it right on entertainment just and don't forget to follow me on my Instagram handle makes underscore Kali and I know you guys will be saying how will you join in look below the screen it's showing all our social media platform just click on the red button that's the subscribe button like comment and share and we'll always be your family just the way we've always been so till we come here again next time on entertainment just it's bye bye from here